All right, so then let's talk about Mattress Running the Numbers. This week, Red Roof Inn is out with an exciting new promotion to earn, I don't know, you stay two times and you earn enough points for a free night at the Red Roof Inn. I mean, what do you think, Greg? Two times, free night. Sounds pretty good. <laughs> I was going to kind of make fun of this, but, but uh, so according to Stephen's post, almost all Red Roof Inns uh, charge 7,000 points a night, that it's like a flat charge for all except for two i think he said um so Where so here's the deal two? you get seven thousand points after two uh stays okay and so i think it actually makes sense in this scenario if you're looking at a very expensive red roof fan if there is such a thing <laughs> which it seems to uh, me like you know the the ones next to a popular national park or, or what have you could very well be very expensive, especially during certain times of year, uh, then here's a way of getting a night cheaply at that hotel because you could probably stay at a $45 uh, red roof nearby, stay two times, so 90 bucks to stay at, you know, what might be a, I don't know, <laughs> $250 stay, something like that. So there's a scenario where I could see it making sense. But let me caution you, I'm pretty sure when I wrote about Sinesta recently, I'm pretty sure they bought um, Red Roof Hotels. Mm, really? Am I remembering that wrong? I thought I, so. Anyway, uh, I probably should have done my homework why? and double check this before, right? <laughs> <laughs> uh, maybe they did. I don't. I don't know. I'm. I'm skeptical. So, Call so me skeptical if, on that. So one. assuming they did, uh, you know, I don't know that these uh, Red Roof points will re ready. The ready points or whatever they're called um, <laughs> will will stay as, in that form, and and so you, and, and what a shame on... it would be if you end up with points <laughs> other than red roof in points. I mean, that would, <laughs> right, right. right. Worst case but, scenario there that I just can't face. That's... <laughs> but but the point is that you know that that red roof in that you were hoping to pay seven thousand points for might end up being a Sinesta something or other that might cost more points. I don't I don't True. really know. True. True. <laughs> True. So, so there's some risk if, there. So so the key is. If you are interested in this promotion, get out there, stay at your two red roof ends as soon as you possibly can and make sure you lock in that 7,000 point booking at your desirable red roof in property. So, and, and, you know, I'm smiling, but I I've, I've stayed at a red roof in once or twice before and they were yeah, just fine. fine. Just like, yeah. Just like a best Western or, you know, there's yeah. a lot of those middle tier sort of chains that are inexpensive. Yeah. So it might be an easy way to pick up a free night, like Greg said. So, so I would say, yeah, I think we're both kind of in the, it's mattress run worthy if you know what you're doing. And yeah. if you don't know Red Roof Inn and don't want to stay at one, then why didn't you skip past this segment? <laughs> so <let's... laughs> What's wrong with you? All <laughs> right. So